Yo, what's going on everybody? How is everybody doing, man? It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay, and today we're gonna be changing up the BMW 650. We're just getting the morning started, but I wanna hit this video off with the good vibes, good vibes only, man. So I hope everybody's having a beautiful and blessed day. Now let's get it cracking. All right guys, we just dropped the car off at Cali Wheels. About to get some wheels installed, mounted, new tires, everything like that. We gotta drop the car off for basically the whole day. They're pretty slammed today, so we're gonna see how it looks after the day is finished. Yo, so we just got home right now, bumping a little bit of ice cube. Ah, I'm just trying to get the summertime vibes going. Right now, man, I need you guys to drop one comment down below your favorite summertime vibes song. I'm working on creating a bigger playlist for Spotify. And if you guys need like any Spotify playlist suggestions or you're interested in what I'm listening to, I could do you guys a favor and just link it down below in the description. I had a couple people ask. I wasn't sure if that was, you know, a thing or not. I don't know if people want to listen to what I'm listening to. So, I mean, just drop those comments. Let me know if you guys need some recommendations. Recommendations. Anyways, it's feeling pretty hot right now. So right now what I'm gonna do is just do a little bit of work I got a main channel video coming and for you guys that are not subscribed to the main channel yet, man YouTube.com slash sneakerhead in the bay. That's where I do all my sneaker stuff uh, Restorations customs reviews all that good stuff, but you're not here on this channel for that So let me give you guys a little bit of insight on what's been going on in my life first things first your boys a little thirsty I've been mad busy. I've been traveling a lot, just doing all of this crazy stuff, man. I haven't had a chance to record all of it, which I do apologize for, but I'm gonna get back into the grind for that. I've been recording a lot of main channel videos and it's honestly been taking a lot of the time that I would have liked to dedicate to this channel, so I'm gonna work on it. It's a little balance. I'm sure you guys understand how that goes. Okay, so my room is looking like a friggin' tornado hit it, so. I should probably clean it up a little bit. I usually never leave my room like a tornado hit it unless I'm like super busy and I just don't got time. Like absolutely no time, not making any excuses. But for some reason, when your bed is all made up, everything is in the right place, man. Your mind is just so much more clear, or at least that's how I feel. So I'm gonna clear my mind right now and clean this room up because this is not doing it for me. See that? Mm mm. Oh man, that is so much better. Why don't you look at that? Yeah, baby. So some of you guys might be wondering what kind of wheel setup we went with for my dad's vehicle. Now, before we even get into that, I wanna give a huge shout out to Cali Wheels and a huge shout out to Vossen. My dad has been trying to get some wheels for his car for the longest time, but we thought that it would be the right moment whenever the tires were basically done. Just being that when he got the car, the tires had a lot of tread left, so he just went ahead, drove it, and now is the time. We figured that changing the wheels, tires, and all that other stuff done at the same time was gonna be the most efficient way and the easiest way to go about this process. If you guys have ever changed your wheels before, you already know, man, whenever you get wheels, you need the wheels, you need the lugs, you to get new tires sometimes you might need a spacer roll the fenders it's just one of those things man that's like if one thing is a little bit off it could throw off everything else so we had them take care of it so huge shout out to my family over there if you guys want to shoot them a follow for any of your wheel needs i will have their links right here all right boys so it is the very next day now the car is done and ended up staying at the shop for a while just because they were backed up with a ton of cars but my dad and i are here in alviso doing a little photo shoot but before we get those photos going i feel like i deserve to show you guys what the car is looking like right now It looks way better, man. Let's check it out. All right, 
right guys, I hope you enjoyed that little bit of B-roll that I got. I don't have a stabilizer or anything, so all of that footage was handheld. If it was smooth and you guys liked it, make sure to hit that like on this video right now, guys. Hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys are wondering about the specs on these, they are 21s. In the rear, we're running a 21 by 10 and a half, and in the front, it's 21 by nine. Lawson always kills it with the fitment, man. For the most part, I wanna say that it is pretty flush. I mean, look at that right there. Like I said, Boston's really good when it comes to the wheel specs, man. You're not running anything too crazy, but it is a lot better than the stock setup. You're not gonna be banging up your fenders on a setup like this, which is really nice when you don't wanna do extra work to your car. And here's what the front is looking like. Honestly, I feel like it could go a teeny bit lower, man. We wanna sit tire to fender. This is the first upgrade to the car we have not touched this car at all until this wheel upgrade now we want you guys to decide what we should do next to this vehicle like i said we're here with my dad and what would you like to do next the front grille should be changed to black currently it's uh, chrome we'll start with that so black this out right here yep interesting interesting then you have the whole vibe and then what's after that Maybe take care of the rest of the chrome. Just delete all the chrome right here. Yeah. Let us know what you guys think about that. Should we delete the chrome? Or leave it? I think it would look pretty sleek if we got rid of the chrome and just kind of made this car a little bit more murdered out. If you guys are wondering about the color of this car, it's actually not black. I know it might look like it in some parts of the, of the video, but when the sun hits it in certain areas it turns this kind of cool like dark blue color right here let me see if i get that focus see that when the sun hits it in the right areas it's blue and over there it's black so it's always like changing pretty sick and if you're curious about the specific wheel setup that we went with these are the Vossen VFS ones we saw a couple videos where some people were doing 22s on it but we went with the 21s as I mentioned before and I believe that the 21s look perfect on this car they don't look too big they don't look too small they're just the right size and hopefully we could do the exhaust next I'm really trying to get my dad to do some more upgrades on his car and just build this up and maybe we could do an oil change on this car soon so, is it is it draining? Yeah. Um. It's falling. Ah oh, oh. oh, shit! This is bad. Oh my god! Wow! No. This is really bad. You stupid. Can you plug up a hole? Or is it too late for that? Just got it too late. Hi. Okay. Nah, just kidding. No. No, 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 I'm just kidding. <laughs> really want to work on this car. I haven't seen too many 650s being worked on on YouTube yet, so see if we could build this together and see where it takes us. Not sure if I'm in focus or not. Probably not, but my neighbor has corgis and we are going to check them out. With the temperature yeah. is mm -hmm. meeting, so it plugs in somewhere on here. I have to take a look at it. Yeah, I don't need a nap. This is what I use. Yeah. <laughs> hey, buddy. I said I'm driving Mercedes My windows not tinted, they look at me crazy I ride through my city I talk to that bitch like, look what you made me We came from the basement